I'm Callie Ritchie, the broker and owner over at Ritchie Realty, and I always say buying real estate is not just buying a home, but it's buying in the community where you're going to live. So come on in and let's take a tour of the Papa Shop. So standing here with me is Beth. Beth, you are the owner here, right? Yes, ma'am. And as we were just talking, I found out you used to be a teacher. Yes, ma'am, I did. Over at Woodland Springs. Woodland Springs. And then somehow you decided, you what, ha what happened? You woke up one day and said, I love popcorn and I'm going to open up a popcorn shop? I, I had a really bad day teaching. <laughs> and I came home and was venting to my husband. Uh -huh. and he thinks he's going to make it better. And he's like, what are you going to do? And I'm like... I don't know, I think I'm quitting and opening a popcorn store. <laughs> and he says, you're doing what? And I go, yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. And 14 years later, here we are. 14 years. Did you have to do some research to figure out how to do all of this? Looked a lot of it online, uh -huh. and then there was a store in Decatur, and contacted uh -huh. the owner of that store, and she let me come out for an afternoon, and just talked about what the business was like, and uh -huh. showed me kind of what to do, and I was like, I can do this. <laughs> Beth is going to uh, take us in a tour here in the back that we're going to go check out. But in addition to the popcorn, you've got all kinds of different things um, that you can do for uh, uh, gifts and stuff like that. Tell us a little bit about what you've got here. Um, we have the tins that you can get. Um, they hold up to three flavors of popcorn and then... This big one, right? That big uh -huh. one, the little guy. Um, and the best part about these are when they're empty, you can bring them in and refill for half oh, price. Half price. So, if you guys are looking for a deal, you bring this back in and you get it for half the price, okay? Um, or we have the basket boxes that uh, get all ribboned and uh -huh. red. And so you've got uh, all kinds of welcome home gifts. You've got, if you wanna do a theater night, you've got that, you've got the big tins. So I understand you make this fudge homemade. Yes, ma'am. All right, so Beth, we're ready to Put you to work because we're ready for some popcorn so take us on a tour and show us how this works is that okay yes ma'am all right let's go so beth what are we doing over, over here just popping a load of buttered popcorn okay so you how much popcorn did you pour in there about 36 ounces of popcorn comes through here uh, and is it just plain popcorn or does it have any flavors to it? This or? will just be butter flavored. It always comes out butter flavored and then we add flavorings and seasonings after. Can you get it without the butter? You can, it just won't taste as good. It won't taste as good. Well, butter makes everything better. <laughs> All right. We've had it heating up. The popcorn's in. How long does it take for it to start popping? Um, it should start any second now. Any second now. All right, so from here, uh, once the popcorn comes out, where do we go next? Um, Usually I'll have a bin here and I'll scoop it into the bin. Okay. And then if we're going to make a sweet or a caramel popcorn, it'll go in this big friend right here. So if you're not going to do a sweet, you would, where do you put, where do you go to add all the different flavors to it? They all have their own little bins. Dill pickle. Now there's a Cajun one. So for all my Louisiana friends, we've got the Cajun popcorn. Salt and vinegar. This is like a like a, like your, all your chips. And all stuff. your chips. Oh, there oh. it goes. Okay, so what are, we, what are we making today? I was gonna make a caramel and blue raspberry. How long does it take to make one of them? Um, it takes about 45 minutes to do the caramel. Okay, so we, we got the popcorn popped over here. What is the process once we come over here? How does that work? So in this big guy right here, we add the sugar and the butter and the uh, flavoring, and this will heat it up to um, candy coat and then it buzzes and you add the popcorn in there and there's huge paddles that will spin it and coat it. And then we dump it out on this table and it cools off. It comes out and it's hot and it's candy coated. Uh -huh. And you, you have paddles and you toss it to cool it and then as it cools, it hardens. And so like what's, you know. what's the key to prevent it from getting soggy? Pray. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta pray, you hear that? <laughs> Teacher in here, we've got them alphabet alphabetized. So 
starting with the A-list, or I guess the first <laughs> one, which one are we gonna try first? This one's beer cheddar. The beer cheddar, okay. That cheddar is right. Oh, that is really good. This one's caramel. Oh, wow. So what do we have here? That one's dill pickle. <laughs> That's a crazy cult following. Okay. Now I know that there's like a dill pickle snow snow cone. I didn't even know that those existed until here recently. So this is gonna be my first time to ever have a dill pickle popcorn. It's not like too powerful. I really thought it was gonna like be really like out front, you know, just too overwhelming. But that's not. It just has like a, just a little hint of it. It's not not overbearing. And what do we have here? That was the jalapeno ghost cheddar. All right, this is the one I really wanted to ch taste. <laughs> 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 that is very ghosty. Yeah. Woo! All right, now I've got to kind of clear my palate. I was like, maybe we should have done that one last. Do <laughs> <laughs> you need some water? My eyes might start watering here in a minute. <laughs> this one's kettle. Okay. This is the, 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 the traditional kettle. Oh, that's really good. All right, and then this last that's one. that's rainbow, so it's all of the fruity flavors mixed together. <laughs> I'm going to try to guess it. Is it pina colada? It's either that or banana. It's Both banana. Yeah. The blue, let's see what this one is. Blueberry? Blueberry. All right, red? Strawberry? Red? I think that one was cherry. Cherry? All right, and then the green, I'm gonna guess that, I'm just gonna guess this is gonna be green apple. It's green apple. All right, so this is really kind of fun. <laughs> Thanks, Beth, for having us in and letting us pop in to see you. I'm sure we'll be back again. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys, so that is a wrap here at Around Alliance. This is Callie Ritchie. You can see I am stocked up with all my popcorn, and who knows, I might be popping in to see you and deliver some of this to you. Take care and have a great week. This one's beer cheddar. Five o'clock somewhere, right? Why not a little beer cheddar? There's no beer in it, though? It's just a beer flavor. It's just a beer flavor. Minute to eat. Okay. Does it look like she's handing it to you? Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Beth, for having us in and letting us pop in to see you. We'll be back again, I'm sure. Thank you. Thank you. Well, that was awkward. <laughs> <laughs> you see how many times I have to like redo uh -huh. it? So, uh -huh. so if that's 20 gallons and you're doing three to four, well, if we do the little bit of math in it, then you're at like uh, four times. <laughs> Oh, I'm